right, we're here at the City of Miami Car Show. Benefits the firefighters from the City of Miami. Let's go check out some of these cars. So check out this beautiful DeLorean. They only made them from 1981 to 83, and it was from one of my favorite movies, Back to the Future. This thing was powered by a V6 engine and had 130 horsepower. I love this car. I'd love to meet this owner and get a ride in this thing. Now check out this 1952 Ford F1 truck. Check out the grill on this thing. It's got that patina look. Check out this interior. Nice and clean. So now we have the 1955 Chevy 3100 second series owned by Jesus aka Black Jesus. I did a video on this guy. You saw the beginning of that, what the truck was when he first found it in the picture, and look at what he's done to it today. This thing is amazing, it's tubbed out. If you want to get more details on this truck and get all the information, go check out my other video. You'll see it in the top right corner. Look at this interior. This thing is customized, even has AC for Miami weather. Now we got this Badass 1965 Ford Falcon. Great condition, 289 engine. Looks all original and it's convertible. Let's go take a look and see what it looks like inside. Nice bench seat. I'm Eddie Acosta. I have a 69 Shelby GT500, grabber orange. So tell me, Eddie, where did you find this thing? A buddy of mine owned it. We got at the car um, in 2009, appraiser Dante, and spent like 12 hours vetting it. And he kept it thinking that Shelby was gonna die subsequently, and he stayed alive a few more years, but the car's never really doubled in price, so I was looking for an R-code Mustang. And for what I was going to pay for one, he told me I'll sell you mine. So I bought it from Brian Thomas from Palm Beach Mustangs. That decal's up in the front. So how long have you had her? A couple years. Yeah? I bought it on layaway. Long story, but I was basically paying him a little bit of cash at a time. Have you had to do anything to this car? I've done a couple of things to it. Yeah, I had to put a fuel pump in and I changed the uh, brake boost. And we couldn't find out of 12 or 15, 20 brake boosts that Brian had. We never found one identical, so we put one on there. That's on there now. And the original, we sent out and I got it redone. It's at the house. I just haven't swapped it. Is this original paint, get, do you know, or uh, is it? No, they got repainted, but it is original color. It was ordered by a Shelby Automotive Executive. Nice. It's the only uh, Shelby or ordered by a Shelby Automotive so Executive. So everything on the car is original, you're saying, you think? I'd say nine, most of it is. Battery is not auto light, uh, little things. Couple things. So you take this car out a lot, or you're just kind of? No, I really don't. No, I don't take it out much. Take it for a little ride every couple of weeks. Uh, my brother's down in the Redlands. I, it's Miami, so it's I'm very, very uh, scared to drive it around. So how does it make you feel when you're driving this thing, man? Cool. Like I'm in the 70s. Now we have a 1955 Chevy Bel Air. Let's check this thing out. Engine compartment looks clean. Paint looks like it's nice and lowered with the big chrome rims. Let's take a look inside this interior. This thing is classic. Manual, love it. Now is another 1955 Bel Air. A little different color, but same condition. Wondering if it's the same owner or their buddies, because it sure looks the same as the other one. It's nice and lowered with the chrome rims. Let's check a look at this one inside. All right. Baby blue. Now we have 1971 or 72 Chevelle, can't tell, but did you see that engine? This thing is awesome. If you're the owner of this car and you see it, or if you know who the owner is, tell me what year it is in the comments. I know it's either 71 or 72, but this thing is sick. The stance on this, the paint, check out those rims. 
Let's take a look and see what it looks like inside. All right. Oh, wow. Nice. Check out this 1962 Corvette. Beautiful candy apple red. Convertible. Let's take a look around the back. It's kind of a tight space here for me, so sorry if I can't get the whole car. Let's take a look inside. Beautiful. Now this is a Caddy, 1970s, don't know exactly the year. Again, if you know the year, if you know the owner or the owner, please comment. Check out the white wall tires. This thing looks like a boat. Take a look around the back. It's got plenty of room in that trunk for some dead bodies, I guess, huh? I'd like to take a look inside, but the windows are closed, but it sure looks nice. Another 1955 Bel Air. I guess this is the popular year here, but this one's a little customized with the headlights, the LEDs, blacked out with the chrome rims. Tight space again. Love it. Look at that stance. I think all these guys are friends. Black interior. And now we got one more 1955 Bel Air. Another one. This is the fourth one in this show. I guess these guys like it. Same thing, got the chrome rims. This thing's a little beefier. Those rims look a little beefier. Very nice. Check out the engine on this Cobra. It's either a 91 or 92 Fox body Ford. Beautiful condition. Check it out. I love those rims. Guys, if you enjoyed this, please leave a comment, subscribe, share with your friends. I make plenty of videos. Every Friday I try to drop a video. So if you like it, give me a thumbs up, subscribe. I really appreciate the support. I leave you with this interior.